Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a Nordstrom anniversary sale review video. Public access to the sale has now gone live so absolutely anyone can shop it even if you don't have a Nordstrom credit card. And I'm going to be going over my must have items from the sale. I've been busy testing everything out and these are the items which I think are truly fantastic and 100% worth the money. So I hope you guys enjoy this and let's get started. So I've been busy testing everything out that I got from the Nordstrom sale and these are my absolute favorite items and I like everything that I got from the sale. I love these items and I think they're 100% worth the money. So I'm going to be going over my top picks. I've been quite stringent with my criteria for this. So unless I really, really love it, it hasn't made this list. And first up are my AG jeans. I can't even describe how much I enjoy these. They are absolutely fantastic. I think I'm even gonna go out a limb and say these are the most flattering jeans I have ever bought. As in, I'm even contemplating getting a backup pair because I'm already so attached them I just can't bear the thought of losing them I love them so much they are perfect in every way they fit amazingly they have a fantastic skinny they have a raw hem they have this little slit here and this isn't what I would choose for my kind of perfect pair of jeans but for some reason it just works on these jeans I read the reviews and everyone else seems to love these as well they only have five star reviews at the moment and someone said that they felt like butter and I completely agree they are so soft they're so comfortable to wear but at the same time they hold you in I just can't say enough good things. So absolutely addicted to these. If you want a new pair of jeans, I would 100% recommend them. I have no idea why they're still fully stocked in sizes because these are incredible. So definitely one of my favorite purchases from the entire sale. These are incredible. Next up, I also wanted to include the other pair of jeans which I got, which were the Good American Jeans. Both jean purchases that I made at this sale were fantastic. They are seriously, seriously great. These ones have a slightly darker wash, but they are also very, very skinny. I wore these out the other day and I wore them with heels. I just love the way they made me feel. I feel like they're very flattering and they kind of hug you in all the right places. I just love these. So huge fan of these as well. If I only had to pick one pair, I'd still go with the AG ones just because they are so perfect. But if you wanted to get two pairs and these are definitely worth a look as well. I'm really impressed with them. I loved wearing them and they're just a fantastic pair. Next up are my ear crawlers and I had to include these because I've been loving them so much. They kind of have mixed reviews online. Um, some people were saying that they're much smaller than they thought they'd be. I'm guessing they didn't see them in store. I do agree. I think the model photo makes them look like larger than they actually are. They are very dainty, but that's why I love them. I have other ear crawlers which are quite large. I don't always find the kind of occasion to wear them just because they do make quite a big statement. Whereas these have that kind of ear crawler look, but they're still dainty enough for everyday wear. And they just have that little bit of edginess, but in the kind of girliest way. So I love these. I think these were less than $30. They're so sparkly and pretty. They come in different kind of tones of metal as well. So if you wanted gold, you get gold. I just went for the kind of more silvery ones. Love these and for like $26, $27, they're just an absolute bargain. So very, very happy with these and definitely one of my favorite buys. Next up, I had to include my Tory Burch crossbody. I've been enjoying this so much. I've used it pretty much every day since I got it and it's been doing so well. I just love pretty much everything about it and the leather quality is beautiful. I actually compared this with my Tory Burch Perry tote, which I also have here. And that was bought full price from Selfridges, I think three or four years ago. And it's exactly the same quality leather. It's this beautiful kind of grained pebbled leather, really nice, very carefree, but it's still very soft and yet it holds its structure very well as well. So love the leather. The layout is really great as well. It's quite messy, I think, but I'm gonna show you anyway. Um, you have the little card slots right here and then a little area for kind of notes or receipts. Um, I have a lot of junk in there at the moment. I need to clear it out, but I've been fitting in my passport holder. I've been using that instead of a wallet, but I think you could fit in a slimline card holder wallet in here. Um, I've been fitting in my a pack of gum, sunglasses, my phone and a lipstick as well. And it's fit all of that very, very comfortably. I love the color. Obviously I'm a pale pink kind of girl, but it also does come in cognac, blue and black. I love the hardware as well. I think it makes it just a little bit more dressy, but the fact that it has a leather strap makes it very comfortable as well. And it's just such a useful little item. So really been enjoying this. I went in store the other day and they were sold out of every color except for black, but this one is still available online. So really been impressed with this, especially the price as well. It's priced at $165. And for the quality that you're getting, I do think it's a very, very fair price. Now I have a couple of shoe favorites and number one on my list are these flats from Cole Han. I love these so, so much. They are so comfortable 
so cute. I love the color, I love the design, I love the comfort and fit, I just love everything about these. They're absolutely adorable. Um, the leopard print ones aren't making the cut only because I haven't had a chance to wear those yet. I've only been wearing these, but they are just as comfortable as I was hoping they would be. I love the fact that there's cushioning all over as well, including on the back. Just really nice attention to detail that makes these just such a comfortable pair of flats. I do think they are so cute as well. You know, I love the point, I love the cutout, the little color contrast, just so adorable. I think these were $100 or $99, something like that. So definitely not super cheap, but for a really nice quality pair of shoes, I'm more than happy to pay that. So definitely a favorite purchase for me. I have been loving these to bits. And then next I had to include my boots and this is one I'm actually cheating a bit on because I haven't worn these outside and the only reason I haven't is because it's super hot in LA and I just didn't want to wear knee high boots. <laughs> but I have been padding around the house in these just to make sure that they are comfortable and I do think that these are a very, very comfortable pair of boots. I also love the look of them. I love the fact that they are quite high. I was looking at the reviews and some people said that they came over the knee um, on them which they weren't looking for so it just kind of depends on your height. These come to literally, I think, bang in the middle of my knee, which is perfect. Um, but that is something to keep in mind if you were maybe more on the petite side. If you didn't want something over the knee, these might not work for you. Um, but I love the fact that these are taller. I'm not a huge fan of under the knee boots anymore. So the fact that these do have that bit of height is great. They have the perfect, perfect heel height. And I love pretty much everything about these. The color is so nice as well. It's a really great neutral. I love the ankle boots I got as well, but if I only had to pick one pair of boots, these would definitely be it. I just think they're such a gorgeous staple. And also the perfect heel height as well, because as I mentioned, when I first got them, you know, I have really high heel boots. I have really flat boots, but I don't have anything in between. So these are ideal and definitely one of my favorite purchases. Even though I haven't had a chance to wear them yet, I'm very excited to get these out when it gets a bit colder. Next up are my jackets and I have three favorites here to share with you and I was debating whether to have three jackets in my kind of top 10 list but I genuinely love all of these and I think they're so great and so great for the price as well so I wanted to include all three. One of them is making a return from last year's anniversary sale and two I bought new this sale. The first one is this One Dot State blazer. I love a good blazer as you guys probably know and I thought this one was a beautiful, very autumn appropriate color. Someone had really good reviews as well. A lot of people commenting on how good the weight was. I completely agree because sometimes you get a blazer which is too heavy, sometimes it's too thin and flimsy, whereas this is ideal. You know, it's a nice mid-weight which means you'll be able to wear it all year round. The color is so pretty. They also have two other colors. I forget what they are. I think black and maybe one other color, but I went for this beautiful kind of a deep plum, just so perfect for autumn, I thought. I love the ruching on the sleeves as well. It makes it very easy to push up because I almost always push up or roll up my sleeves. I just think it makes the blazer a little bit more wearable. I love the fact that it has lining as well, so it's really solid quality. Has some slight padding on the shoulders just to give it that nice structure. And I love this, such a great item, really nice quality and just another total win from One Dot State. And speaking of other really stellar blazers, the one that I'm bringing back from last year is my J. Crew one. I didn't actually talk about this blazer that much last year because it sold out pretty much immediately, but they brought it back this year and it's still in stock in all sizes and colors. So I would 100% recommend this. I love it. It's become one of my go-to blazers. The fit is absolutely perfect. I did mention in my other video that you have to really size down though. So I got a zero zero in this. So again, if you're smaller than me, then it may not work as well on you, but I love this so much. Again, the perfect weight. It doesn't crease easily. It's a beautiful quality. It has that lining, also that little kind of piping detail here. The navy is a beautiful shade, but it also comes in a bright yellow. It comes in a bright blue and also black as well. So something for everyone, but for me, navy is just such a great classic color. And I can't say enough good things about this blazer. So one of my favorites of all time and the fact that it is on sale at such great price is just a total added bonus. And the last jacket that I wanted to mention was my blank NYC jacket. I love this so much. This one is a faux leather, but it's really, really lovely to feel. Sometimes faux leather can be very plasticky and not very nice, but this is so unbelievably soft. If you'd hold me, it was real leather. I probably believe you. It is quite lightweight though, which I think is the only thing that gives it away, but the feel of it is so buttery soft. And then you have this beautiful kind of suede-like texture on the inside. 
I love this. I wore this out the other day with my AG jeans and just a cami with this over the top and I loved it. I felt so great in that outfit and for the price, I think this is an absolute snip. So love this so much. Another really great one from Blank NYC and definitely worthy of inclusion in my top 10. And then for my very last item, I totally cheated and I fit two items in one because I couldn't decide, but they're both so great and I wanted to mention them both. I did mention these in my first anniversary sale video as items to look out for and I completely stand by that. They are so, so great and they're at really good prices for the anniversary sale. So the Beauty Bio Glow Pro is basically a micro dermabrasion tool. Um, it's just a kind of mild one. It's not the same intensity as what you get in clinics, obviously, because I think you need to be qualified to use those. So this is a much gentler version, but it's so incredibly effective. You basically run it all over your face and it creates micro tears in the skin, which sounds horrific, but it's not painful. Um, it's, you can feel something, but it's not like, it doesn't put me off using it at all. Like, and I'm quite sensitive to pain, so I'm totally fine using this. And basically because it opens up little micro tears in the skin, it makes your skincare absorb so much more. So if you have it really effective skincare, it basically supercharges it. The effect is amazing. You will see an immediate difference in your skin and I've been hooked using it ever since. But another tool that I've been loving is my new face as well. And this is basically a face sculpting tool. So you can't really feel this at all. You can feel the Glow Pro a little bit, but you really can't feel this at all. You just put gel over your face and then you kind of just glide it over in a certain way. And it's incredible. And they actually tell you to do half your face first so you can see the difference. And the difference is insane. You will be 100% hooked. I do have a favorites video coming up where I'm showing you exactly how I use this because I've been very much in love with it, but seriously great. If I could only pick one, I think it would just depend on what my biggest skin issue was. So if I was really concerned about fine lines or wrinkles, I would go with the Glow Pro. But if I was more concerned about sagging or kind of just the overall shape of my face, then I'd go for the new face. So. Both are great, I use both in combination. I use this a couple of times a week and then I use this the rest of the time. Totally addicted to both though and during the sale you can get them for great prices. This one is actually the mini one but you can get the full size version in the sale. I think you get over $100 off which is incredible. And then with the Glow Pro you get an entire set. So really great value, would recommend both. I've been loving these so much. So that is it for this video guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I will leave links to everything I featured down below in the description section along with sizes and any other relevant info. But if you did have any other questions for me, then leave me a comment. I did also want to say with regards to restocks, if you did have your eye on something but you missed out on it, I'd always say to bookmark the page and check back because I am seeing restocks happen several times a day throughout the day. So if you did really have your heart set on something, then just check back whenever you can because I I am seeing stock come in, but then it also does seem to go out quite quickly as well. I don't think these are big restocks. I think it just as and when items get returned, but definitely a good way to grab something if you really did want it. Thank you so much for watching guys. I will see you in my next one. Bye.